I enjoy the sort of team spirit aspect of it and uh, also I guess the, the feeling that you can, um, like self-improvement. In our crew we've got, um, we've got guys from UCL, LSE, Kings, Brunel, so we sort of pull the, the best athletes and uh, try and make the fastest boat with all of them in. What's, what's really awesome is some of the guys in the, in the crew have uh, only really started rowing um, and picked it up at university and have come on such a long way. So um, we've got some guys who, who've only been rowing sort of for about two or three years. The role of the cox is to steer the boat. On a river like this it's all about finding where the stream is, the fastest part of the river and you've got some bends to navigate as well. A little bit like a captain, you've got to be telling the guys what to do, but at the same time, you've got to be giving technical points and motivational points and tactical points when you want to push, uh, when you want to move on other boats, when you want to start winding for the line. We, we train um, probably just over 14 sessions a week. Thursdays we're on the water at 6am and then we need to rush down to uni and have a full day of lectures and whatever. Um, we've got a full, day, uh, full weekend of training, about three or four sessions usually at the, uh, across the whole weekend. And what, what keeps you going then? Uh, what keeps me going? Uh, some, sometimes I wonder that myself when I'm getting up at uh, 5 in the morning to come down on a freezing cold day, but uh, just crew camaraderie, uh, that girl. Generally just loving the sport. You know, if you don't love what you do, there's absolutely no point carrying on. So I think just loving the sport, really.